Welcome to the Creating Fill-in-the-Blank Questions in the Question Library demo. In this demo, you will learn how to create a fill-in-the-blank question in the Question Library. At the end of this demo, you will be able to create a fill-in-the-blank style question for your assessment. First, log in to your Desire to Learn account and go into your course. On the course navigation bar, click on the Assessments link. Notice the tabs at the top, Manage Assessments, Question Library, and Statistics. Click on the Question Library tab. Click on the section name to go into its folder. From the new drop-down button, click on the question type you want to create. To create a fill-in-the-blank question, pick that option from the new drop-down button. You can leave the title of the question blank. Doing so will make the question text show up as the title. You can leave the points value set to 1. This number can be changed later when you create your assessment. If you want to add an image to go along with this question, click on the Insert an Image button and locate the image on your computer, and then click the Add button. Notice the Add blank and Add text buttons. We will use these later. This question type is set up so that you type in text, then there is an answer blank on the next line and then there is more text. Click in the first text field and enter in the first part of your question. Example, to increase student participation in the D2L class, use the, the blank number field choices are for the size of the answer box you want the students to see on the test. The answer box is for the right answer. The weight box is for how much credit the student will get for answering the box correctly. If there is only one blank in the question, this should be 100. If you want to give multiple right answers for the blank, use the Add Answer text. Example, Discussion fifty percent click in the text field and enter in the next part of your question example tool and to collect homework use the Click Add Blank and then click Add Text. Click on Answer, Example, Dropbox, click Add Answer. Example, drop space box. Both of these are worth 50%. Click in the text field. Example, tool, period. Click on the preview button to see what the question will look like to the student. Click the done button 
to return to the question. When you're finished making changes, click on the Save button in the bottom left hand corner and you will return to the section list. If you want to create another question very similar to this one, click on the Save and Copy button. That will save this question and create another one with all of this question's information so that you can edit this information instead of retyping it. If you want to create another question of this same type, click on the Save and New button. That will save this question and give you a new blank question of this question type. You have now successfully created a fill in the blank question in the question library. To return to the question library, click on the question library breadcrumb trail. Or click on the Done Editing Questions button to return to the Assessments tool.